first on this date in 1965, Edward R. Murrow died. That was just two days after his 57th birthday and just four years after he had left broadcasting to join the Kennedy administration as the head of the U.S. Information Agency. Of all the remarkable things about the great journalist's career, the one mentioned least was its comparative brevity. He had joined CBS in 1935 and left it early in 1961, barely 26 years later. Let's play Oddball. We begin in the Cummins supermarket in Ballon Robe, Ireland, where they're having a run on beef. He's after me, Lucky Charms. This bull was freed from his pen at a nearby cattle farm. He then made his way through the market's automatic doors and decided to pick up a few things while he was there. Eventually, the cattle farmer made his way into the store. Anybody seen a bull? It's him doing the 180 because the bull found him. Sometimes you're the bull and sometimes you're the cattle farmer. He led the bull back out of the store and back to the farm. Luckily, no humans were hurt. And ground chuck is now on sale. And with no offense to those who have another nominee, for my money, the funniest, deepest sitcom in the English language has just been released on DVD as a full series for the first time by E1 Entertainment. The Fall and Rise of Reginald Perrin, the BBC's series from the late 70s, which masterfully captured the amazing futility of working in an office, especially when the star, the late Leonard Rossiter, interacted with his cliché-consumed boss, the late John Barron. I want a holiday, CJ. I want a holiday, and I want it now. Do you not? Uh, yes, I really must ask you for at least four, four, four well, uh, not less than three. Certainly not less than three days. <laughs> yeah, it's a bad time to ask you can't spare me. Yes, I quite understand. I just thought while I was here, CJ, I would uh, bring a long weekend. No, absolutely impossible. That's the question. I quite understand. Thank you anyway, CJ. Sit down! <laughs> You're on edge. You need a holiday. Uh, yes, that's why I asked you for one, CJ. Impossible. I'll tell you what we'll do, though. We'll compromise. I didn't get where I am today without learning how to compromise. <laughs> Take the afternoon off. 